<coughs> ah, hello. Um, basically, um, we think that me and Joe be off well. So much um, options um, available lately. Um, talk about you know many issues. Um, so um, yes, I want to talk about first. Um, I think because it's um, Halloween. Um, well, just gone, but um, I've got this still dark out there, so um, we don't know what's out there at the moment. I'll talk to you about the spirits and um, if they exist. Um, can we see spirits? Can we not see spirits? Are those who claim they can see spirits um, mental, got mental illness problems? Um, are the people who claim those people who see spirits got mental illness problems? And friendly to um, into mental mental home, out of order or what? Well, the strange thing is, um, recently I did some meditating. Um, I predicted that I saw um, sense and spirit in the park um, as of late. Um, what this even is is what I've had it for some time now. It's um, it can happen in three, a few different ways. What one way is where y it won't let you go free. It won't let you wake up. Um, you can't move. Other one is where um, you have a false awakening. That can be. I've been told it can be very very dangerous. Um, basically, what happens is you think you've woken up. Everything around you is sim. It's pretty much the same. Apart from one, two differences. So you know, if you remember what was in your what was in your living room or your bedroom when you went to sleep, and what's in your house, then you know that if it's a false awakening, or if the thing is real, of course. Another one is um, I've had out of body experiences in my sleep, but haven't had them for um, a very long time. Um, I've been advised to just let it, let it, let it go with me, and not try and find a way out of it. Me being freaked out, but of course I got freaked out because when it first happens to you, you don't know what to do, you don't know what to expect. And the thing is now I'm fully ready for it. They stop coming to me now. It's like I wasted the opportunity, but you know, it'd be natural to get freaked out. I mean, who wouldn't? I mean, you just. You see yourself so, so rise up into the rise not rise not right. No one can do that. No one can rise their body at, um, at any cost. I mean, jumping, yeah, but you don't jump and then float. Um, what else? I've had um, I've had spirits come to me in the sleep, um, which brings me on to what's out there. Um, Recently, um, scientists have found some new planets, about 30 to 40 planets, um, and they've built the, the size of them. Um, I can confirm to you that one of those planets, at least one of the planets, is a living planet and has living species in them because I've had something come into my mind um, and I wasn't thinking about them. Um, as you know, Namix and the um, one came into me said it turned me it's okay to enter. I think it was a ghost and saying it's my turn, my time to die, and I shouldn't be scared. Um, and they come in what's most pleased to you. I I don't know. I mean, I wasn't thinking about 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 any Namix at the time. I wasn't thinking of the popular manga. Well, like anime, or those who don't know what an anime manga is, it's a ca Japanese cartoon. Um, I wasn't thinking about the the program that they appear on at all. I wasn't thinking about the land. I wasn't thinking about anything. I was just sleeping there, and one appeared to me out of nowhere. Um, since then, they've been contacting me. I mean, this is. I mean, it's, this is not like I've um, been like trying to think about it. I mean, 
but then when I do start thinking about it and I'm thinking are they going to contact me that's when I don't know whether it's me or whether they are contacting me um, so what I need to do is, is to stop thinking if they're going to contact me again um, but yeah one of the planets that I believe that one of the planets is a living planet has living species in them and they're one of them now we look at our race today like and we look at the earthlings and we all got the predictions most people in this planet in this planet think the world's planet's going to end the world's going to end come to an end very very soon 2012 for those who are rubbing their hands hoping it's going to happen bad news people it ain't unless you want unless you're on about your own life then maybe so the world's not going to end i mean yes we may have an antichrist now it's been in the bible about the antichrist coming up but what they didn't reject is do we think with two seconds that the lord god and jesus christ didn't have a trick up the tree sleeves i mean think about it if they put that if put down the bible or hints or clues that antichrist is going to emerge seven years of seven years of peace to make people think he's good and that and then after seven years seven years of hell you know we don't we can't just put back that god didn't think well hang on mate he's going to do that so we're going to send someone to planet on the onto earth maybe from another planet maybe f from the heavens we don't know and uh, we don't know it is i mean could be me could be someone else um so they sent i've sent someone to stop the antichrist it's counted now the person who stops the antichrist will know who to stop when he meets him or when he comes close with him we can't see when he's going he could stop the antichrist long before he starts to get into power full stop the antichrist for we can know could have just been born today and could be killed tomorrow before things take part now christians said that the antichrist will be in power for seven for seven years of good seven years of bad that's 14 years but at the same time they did not end the world in 2012 which doesn't add up because if you think about it if you take it's 2009 now how the hell does this work out how the how the hell can the antichrist be a part he should already already be a part now but the hell we're going through is not as much as bad as they predicted um a lot of um i mean with um with like spirits i've i've seen um also seen spirits in it going back to spirits of course i've also seen spirits well, not seeing it, sense them in Weatherspoons. Um, I don't see them, but I do sense them there. I mean, from time to time. Um, and um, it's rather interesting. I mean, what's actually out there, what's not out there. Um, when we we're looking at the moment, we what what's really out there. Scientists are trying to prove Christians are, and we're all having a war against you. Um, Sciences at the moment are wasting the time when they are doing the on Mars to find life on Mars. Waste of time, there's no life on Mars. Mars is too close to Earth to be life. All these living planets are, are far away from each other, they're not impossible to get to if we use the right technology, the right equipment, the right equipment, and the right people to get there. Or bring people from their planets to it to us. We just gotta need to think how to do this. Build spaceships and I think with extra speed to them. Um I'm just gonna wrap this up now. Um Halloween is pretty as exciting part. Um if you want to have fun of Halloween, meditate, go into woods. And do it any time. I mean, it's not just Halloween you can do this. I mean, any time. 